Okay, we have Mr. Bilal. How are you, Bilal? How are you doing, Christian Prince? I'm fine, my What's friend. What's going on? How are you? Good, good. Not bad. So, Bilal, you are a Muslim, right? Not bad. You know who I am, Christian Prince? No, not really. I do not know. We spoke two times, uh, I think, uh, two months ago. Oh, okay. Sorry, I don't remember. Okay. Yes, yes. Go ahead. Yes, I am Muslim, though. Yes, alhamdulillah. You speak and I want to say right? assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh to my brothers and sisters who are uh, watching. Hmm. Uh, go ahead. So go ahead, Christian Prince. So you said assalamu alaikum to the Muslims only, right? Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Yes. To, to the, the Muslims. Muslims. Okay, what do you say to the Christians? May Allah curse you. What do you say to them? Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum. To the Christian too? Yes, to the Christians too. But I thought you can say that. Well, I just did. So, uh, are you a good Muslim or you are disobeying your prophet when you do that? Wallahi, uh, we, we as human beings, we have ups and downs in life. So, okay. I will never let uh, to uh, Zaki and Fusukum. I will never uh, praise myself. It's another question, my friend. I'm asking you. As I know, your prophet. Yeah, I'm telling, and I'm telling you, am okay. I a good Muslim or not? I'm telling you, I have ups and downs. No, no, I'm not gonna I'm, say I'm, yes. Okay, Bilal, I'm talking about certain things. You said assalamu alaikum to the Christian, which means peace to you, Christians, correct? Yes, to okay. my true Christian. I say to the true Christians, okay, not the okay, who, not the fake ones, not the fake ones. Okay, who is the, the true Christians who? are the ones that believe in one God. Oh, okay. But okay, I will go yes. with you now. So, guys, if you are a true Muslim, a true Christian who believe in one God. All of us we believe in one God. All Christians believe in one no, God. No, you, you, you don't. You don't believe. You believe God had a son. Oh, okay. So if you are a Christian who believe God have a son, what do you say to them? Curse you or what? No, not curse you. Allah uh, May Allah guide you guys. Okay, but is it the, okay? But isn't it the Quran says Allah guide not who He deceived? Allah guide who? Allah guide not who He deceived. Allah guide not who He deceived. Yes. Uh, you, you're asking me questions. Just please, like, make a topic and then make a point. No, this is my. This is our topic. We are continuing. Is it the Quran says, "Allah He guide not those who they, He deceived." Yes, the the, the, the ones who are uh, who are deceivers. No, no. It does not guide. Them. It doesn't say that. It says those who he deceived. He deceived. Who, who, who Allah deceived? Yes. Okay. I'm. Uh, okay. Okay. I mean, do you know what I'm talking I, about, I or know. you are, uh, or you are just saying okay without I, me? I... <laughs> no, no. I, I, I would, I would uh, enlighten me. Enlighten me. Okay. So, have you ever heard that Allah said in the Quran, <laughs> Allah guide not who He deceived? Yes. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Can you say it in Arabic? Maybe in Arabic it sounds more. Uh, okay. Can you say it in Arabic? Yes. 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 He will not guide him. Okay, guys. So Allah is so, the one who guides. So, so yeah, yes, friend, Allah is the one who guides people, and he and he uh, misguides people. Yes. Okay, thank you. So, guys, we heard our friend Bilal here confirming that Allah is the devil. He is the one who misguides people. Yes. Uh, yes. But he, but, he, uh, but, he, how, but how does he guide and how does he misguide? That's the question. How he misguide? Tell me. He, how he misguide? Through tell action. Me. Through action. Amal salah. No, but he said. Amal Okay, so Allah. Say, yeah. Okay, so Allah He misguide yeah. us by making us do bad things, correct? No, 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 no. He, he misguide doesn't us? misguide us by making us. How? You do bad things and you get misguided. You no, do good things, no, 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 you no, get no, no, guided. No, no, no. You see the Quran saying, "Are you going to guide the one who Allah misguide?" So, yes. If, okay, so what the verse is saying clearly but, that you cannot so guide what someone. What does that person do? You cannot guide what does someone. What does that person do? In his life, whatever he do, it was Allah who misguided him to do that. Yeah. What does Allah say? The, the verse is so clear. What does, it says, what does Allah say to what does, going, what does Allah say to Adam when he sends them down to earth? What does Allah say what, to Adam when he sends them down to earth? What Allah said to him? Tell me. What are you? 
you know the ayat Surah Al-Baqarah. I'm driving. I can't bring it up, but go to Surah Al-Baqarah. Uh-huh. Go to the ayah where he sends them down to earth okay. and read it in Arabic and let's translate it. Okay. What does he say to him? Okay, let me ask you first. I will go there. Did Allah go ahead, go did, there. did Allah deceive Adam and Adam was a victim of Allah or Adam he committed sin? Adam Adam committed disobeyed Allah's command. What is the proof that he disobeyed Allah's command? He uh, ate from the the tree. Okay, but isn't it your prophet he says that Allah he planned for Adam to eat from the tree 40 years before he created him? Yes, I, we know that Allah knows the, uh, the knows the future. No, this is not about we knowing, know that Allah knows This is not about knowing the future. There's a, there, there's it is a hadith. Knowing the future. There's a hadith. It is no, about, no, no, my friend, it's about this. No, thing. no. It's about, to, but please go to the uh, verse in the Quran, please, before you uh, go go to another uh, okay, hadith. What, what verse you want me to go to? There's many verses. Your prophet. What's the, what's, it's in the it's in the beginning of the story in Surah Al Baqarah, yeah. chapter two, okay. where uh, he sends. Um, Adam down to earth, and then okay. what does he say to him after? I would like to for you to just translate that to the people. Okay, we we we'll go there and we will laugh together. Here we go. In chapter two, chapter two, verse number thirty-six, it says, "And Satan, he made them slip from the garden, hmm? mm-hmm. and then Allah he yep. said to them, get down.' Correct? Exactly. Yeah. Okay. Get down from and where? Then? Get down from where? Hold on a second. That's that's not the point here. What what next? Keep going. Okay, and then and uh, we will make uh, read it all. Please. We, we will make them, all, we yeah. will make your enemy to each other. So you're not going to read the part where it says, "And if if uh, guidance comes for me, okay. whoever follows the guidance." Well, okay, can, no, can it's you read not, that part? it doesn't say that, my friend. It says, it says, and uh, then he learned Adam. He learned Adam from his Lord words of inspiration. And his Lord turned yeah. toward him, for he of returning most merciful. So the translation is funny. It says here that Adam he repent, you know, or he receive words from Allah, and then Adam he repent, yeah. and Allah he accepted his repent. Is that what you're yeah. talking about? No, not that. After that. Okay. Then we say to them, all of you. Okay. I'm just I'm just reading a sentence after yeah. sentence. Then Allah he says, yeah. Sorry, get get down, get down, yeah. all of you of this place. Okay, and yeah. and whenever guidance, okay, when uh, guidance from me, and whoever yes. follow my guidance, yes. there shall be no fear f- yes. on them, and shall no they grieve. Okay, so do you accept yes. this verse? So th- there we go. So this is the verse I'm talking about. Okay. So this is the for every man that has ever been created from Adam till now. All right. Every man, uh-huh. he follows this law. This law. Okay. When God sends, uh, gives you guidance yeah. or a Sorry, when when you do good things mm-hmm. that God has guided you to, uh, to do uh, to, uh, to to you to do, and you do them, God will continue to guide you. Okay. God will continue to guide you until you get to paradise. All right. But if you do the opposite, mm-hmm. where the where where Satan or the Shaitan or whatever you want to call him, mm-hmm. when you do the opposite, you go down a, the wrong path. Okay. And this is something that the Christians cannot disagree with because uh, the Christians also have. Uh, you know, Satan in their in their book as well, who he tries to misguide the people. Hmm. Am, I, so, am I wrong on that? Or? Okay, you are done. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. All right, ahead. but but if we if we put the two verses you choose for me, the verses where I showed you, chapter four, verse number eighty-eight, where it says, "Are you going to guide the one who Allah is guide?" And you agree with it. It says that. And then you showed me the verse in chapter two, verse number thirty-eight, where it says, "When guidance, my guidance come to you." But in the other verse says, "Are you going to guide the one who I am is guide?" So guidance of Allah will not come to the one who Allah is guide. And every single human being is misguided by Allah, starting from Adam. Do you agree with that's me? That's right. That's right. That's okay. right. That's right. That's right. No one gets. Uh, uh, that no man can guide another man. You have to understand that no man can guide another man without God's uh, intervention in it. No, this so is God a, this is the one who guides and he misguides. This is not what the verse says. No, this saying. is he's speaking. To, no, no. There, there's saying, another verse where he speaks friend, to Prophet Muhammad prophet, directly, okay, and he tells him. Okay, he's saying to Muhammad. He tells him, "Okay, are you going to guide the one who I am guide? Which means he's doing wrong when he tried to guide the one Allah is guide, correct? 
who's doing wrong? Muhammad is doing wrong? Yes, Allah is saying to him, are you going to guide the one who I am his guide? Correct? Yes. Okay. okay. That's mean. That's mean. It is not right to guide the one I did lie to him and I deceived him because how Allah misguide people by making them believe in wrong belief. Sorry, how does he misguide people? Sorry, I didn't get that. Yes, how, how, Allah, how Allah he misguide people by making them what? What when I say misguide, I'm talking about belief. I'm not about a look. If a person he is uh, uh, he don't put uh, nice. Uh, CP, CP, CP. Okay. If you're gonna say the story, say say the full story, please. I, I'm the, story, the full story is, the is very first, clear. Is, okay, let us go and see the whole story. So, Thank you very much. This is, no, no, the full this story is, is very clear. The is, full story. Let me finish. This is your prophet. This is the, your the prophet. Satan, uh, Bila, Bila. Satan disobeyed God. No. Or the Shaitan no. or Ablis, first, whatever you want to first, call him. First, Shaitan. Obeyed God. First, Satan. God sent him and Adam down to earth. Okay. Hold Satan on. said, "I'm going to misguide all your guys. I'm going to misguide your creation." Okay. Let me ask you. Is Shaitan, God said, "Okay." Is Shaitan is against but, Allah or he worked for Allah? He's against Allah. Can you show me a proof? He's against. What do you mean? Show you proof? I just told you what he said in the Quran, where he says, "I'm gonna misguide everyone." I'm gonna. Well, he's gonna attempt to misguide everyone, and then God says, "You cannot misguide." No. Uh, you see, uh, Shaitan, I, uh, Shaitan he is an employee of Allah. Chapter six, verse one twelve. It says, "And we have appointed for every prophet enemies, shayateen." All of us are employees to God. All of us are, are servants to God. That's another question. So Shaitan is employee of Allah and he is doing the work for Allah to be the enemy of the Prophet. Correct or not? That's not what Allah says in the Quran, though. Huh? That's not what Allah says in the Quran. That's not what he says in the Quran. I, I, I don't understand. Say again. That's not what he says in the Quran. In the Quran, he, he tells uh, uh, the Shaitan to bow down to Adam. He doesn't bow down. Hmm. And then he, he is. Uh, I, I, like kicked out of uh, kicked out of uh, wherever he was, mm -hmm. and and it sent down to earth, and he first became all, the enemy. First of all, very clear. First of all, the, that's not the point. CP, first CP. of all, the verse you are talking about have nothing to do. Allah is ordering shaitan. Nowhere in the verse it says Allah he ordered shaitan. Allah he ordered the angels to bow down to Adam. He did not say shaitan bow down. Which is, a, which is showing the mistake in the Quran and contradiction and you know silly mistake. Because when Allah he order, he order only the angels to bow down to Adam. The same chapter you quote for me is a chapter two, verse number 34. And remember when we said to the angels, protest yourself before Adam. And they protested except shaitan but allah did not order the shaitan to bow down he ordered the angels and according to islam right, shaitan, this shaitan, goes, is another, this to, shaitan is not this an angel to, hold on hold on hold on so this, this is back, so this is a mistake and this is silly mistake of the author of the no Quran. no no this goes back to your ignorance of the arabic language and, okay. and my ignorance of the arabic language okay. obviously you're you're not an arabic scholar uh -huh. uh, but here we have uh, many uh, like a thousand, let's say a thousand angels in one and one iblis in the hmm. in the congregation. He okay. tells them all to bow down, okay, and and uh, they all bow down. All the angels, nine hundred and ninety nine, bow down. Let's just say, okay, and iblis doesn't bow down. Okay, it's, I don't know the Arabic, and you don't know CP one hundred percent. I know you don't know the Arabic uh, language that well. To actually understand this, because in the other ayah, he talks about the shaitan being a jinn, at least mm. being a jinn. Mm. Correct or not? Mm -hmm. Are you done? And I'm in a jinn. Are you done? Are, was, he, was he from the jinn or not? Are you done? Yes, he is. Are you done? Yeah, he's from, he's from the jinn. Okay. So, so, the excuse of not knowing Arabic, this is very silly, because I'm showing you the Islamic translation, and all of them, they don't say that shaitan, he was one of them. The, 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 the Quran is so clear in Arabic and in English. It says, We said to the angels, we said to the angels, bow down. So if Allah, he says, all of you bow down, whoever there is going to bow down, he did not say that. He said, I said to the angels, so Allah, he chose exactly 
the kind of the one who will bow down because it was the angels who accused Adam he would do mischiefment and it was not Iblis one of them so what your answer is is very silly and have nothing to do with the Quran you are making your own excuse to cover up the stupidity of the verse not, because the one uh -huh. okay who is the one accused Adam would do mischiefment is it shaitan or the angels uh, sorry, can you read the other ayah, please? Uh, no, 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 I, I want you to answer me. Who is, the one, who is the one who accused Adam to do mischiefment, Shaitan or the angels? The, the angels were, the angels. Okay, so the, the normal thing is to punish the angels, not the one who did nothing wrong. So the angels is the one who accused Adam. Allah get upset from them because oh, no, they that, said that. that has nothing to do with the sajda. Huh? has nothing to do with the sajda. Uh, that has nothing to, to do no, with the Jews. No, it have to do with read the verse. No, read the verse before it. No, read, read the verse before it. He said to them, let me teach you. Okay, listen, listen, listen. When they said when we, when they said that Adam will do mischiefment, Allah he taught Adam all the names. Hold on. Allah he taught Adam all the names to prove to them that they are a bunch of liars. The Quran confirmed that angels of Allah are a bunch of liars. They are not, not a bunch of liars. They don't prove. No, not a bunch okay. of liars. Did Allah? Did Allah say it's to the angels? Where did Allah... you get lying from? Can you show me the word? Hey, Where do you get lying it's from? A, it's, it's they, a, they accused Adam. It's in the front of me. It says. Okay, it's in the front of no, me. No, it says. It Adam. says. Hold on. It says. In he, kuntum sadiqeen. Translate to the audience, please. Vila, do you speak Arabic? <laughs> when Allah He said, "In kuntum sadiqeen," translate for me. What "in kuntum sadiqeen" mean? If you are truthful, truthful. Thank you. That's mean they are truthful. But then what does he do after? What he do? He punished what them. What does he do? After? He punished them. He examined no, them. No. He examined them. He, he, he taught Adam the names and he said to them, tell me the names. Tell me the names of those things. If you are truthful, which means if you cannot tell me the names, you are not truthful. <laughs> okay. Then what did he say? He said, if... You see, I told you, I know what you do not know. No, this is not the, I know this is not the question. Did Allah, he said to them, tell me the names of those things if, they, if you are truthful? Yes. He did not say if you are a person who knows. He said if you are truthful. In Kuntum Sadiqeen. And the Muslim, they claim that Allah speak perfect Arabic. And Allah, he used the word clearly saying, if you are not lying, which means if you are truthful, which means if you are truthful, tell me the names of those things. If you fail to tell me the names of those things, you are not truthful. Well, what did he say after? He, he told them, I, okay, so what? He, so I know what you do not know. So I have to okay, do okay, something with knowing. Okay, so so when, when the angels, they claim to know, oh, that means they are lying. Did they claim that they know? Did they claim that they know? Yeah. They, yes, they accused. They didn't claim that they know. They accused. No, they accused. That means it's a false execution. Okay, it's a, it's a false ac ac accusation or a true accusation? A false accusation or a true accusation? Yeah. It is what it is. What the people this did after that. Hey guys, look at the answer. It is what it is because he's afraid not to answer. No, it is. is it a false accusation no, it against Adam or it is not? Against Adam himself? No, it wasn't uh, a false accusation. It was not. So Allah is a liar then. Because Allah said to them, no. tell me the name of those things if you are truthful about what you said about Adam will do mischievement. <laughs> okay, what's the what's the Christian perspective in that? In this that is not, scenario? Don't change the topic. Don't change the topic. So no, no, not you, changing the topic. You're just just accused, topic. You're I would just love to know. You're just I would love to know the Christian perspective. Please. Later we can finish this and we can go to the Christian. Now you are I'm trying. You. You, are trying you. Escape, you. you are trying to escape. I'm not 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 trying to escape. You are trying. I told you. Are, you are okay. Then don't change. We can go there after we finish this one. I'm not changing. I'm telling you. You're asking you. As long as everybody heard you saying. That the, 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 the accusation, the accusation against Adam was Are truthful. You? They were right. You said that. You said the accusation the angels made against Adam was a truthful. So when Allah He said to them, "Tell me the names of those things if you are truthful," that means Allah Himself was not the truthful one because they are the truthful, and you admit that. And Allah is against them for saying something not a truthful, challenging them. If you are truthful, to tell me the names of those things, and because now they could not tell him the names of things, He said to them, "I know what you know not," which means you are wrong and you are untruthful.
So now I'm asking you, the accusation against, against Adam, when you said it is truthful, did Allah make the stupid mistake by saying that Adam is not going to do what the angels said? No, it's not a stupid mistake because we do not understand this whole universe. We do not understand how things work. What does have to do with we my question? We do not understand how things work. Why, why, we, switch, why we switch well, now to answer, talk about it? Why we switch about not, talking not about the universe work. now? I'm asking you a specific question about a guy. His name is Adam. I'm, how I'm, this had to do yes, with the universe? Adam, Listen, I'm I told asking you. you I, Adam, I told you my perspective on Adam, that. he was accused to do mischievement. Allah, he said, get, tell me the names of those things if you are truthful. Which means, Allah, he said, if you cannot tell those names, you are not a truthful. Do you agree? If you cannot tell me the names, you are not truthful? Yes. No, he did not say you are not truthful. Man. Well, read the verse then. Here we go, guys. I, I don't know what's wrong with those said, I know what you do not know. That's no, 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 no. Read carefully. Know. Verse number 31, it says, and let me yes. read for you. And he taught uh, Adam all the names of everything, and then he showed them to the angels, and he said, Tell me the names of those things if you are truthful. So if they are truthful, correct. they will be able to tell the names of those things, correct? You are truthful, yes? Okay, you can tell but, me that, uh, okay, but they were not able to tell the names, so they are truthful. Okay, so... What do you mean, okay? So, A second ago you said they are yeah, truthful. No, no, I'm, I'm, I'm with you, I'm with you, CP, I'm with you, CP. Okay. I'm telling you, I'm telling you that they uh, they say, they, they said something, hmm. then Allah taught Adam something, and then Allah sh showed it to the angel, Hmm. The angels didn't know what it was, hmm. and then Allah tells them, I know what you do not know. Hmm. And then you ask me, and I'm going to be honest, you ask me, uh, uh, were the angels right? Mm -hmm. Do we have killing on earth? We do have killing on earth. Okay. Do we have people that mischief? We do have people that mischief All right. on earth. That's correct, 100%. Okay. Now, do I know what that means? No, I don't. Do I? <laughs> That's, so that's my answer to that. Now answer? I'm asking you. No, no, where's the answer? Hold on, hold on. Your Christian the perspective. What is the answer? The angels they say to Allah, What's your that answer Adam, to that? are you going to create someone with doom achievement? Allah, He said to them, Tell me the names of those things that you are truthful. Truthful about what? About He would do achievement. And you just said, Adam, He did killing. His children did killing. They did mischievement. So when Allah He changed the angels, right. when Allah He changed the angels, saying to them, "If you are a truthful, truthful about an accusation they made against Adam." So you just admitted yeah. that the angels they were right and Allah was wrong. What kind of God He have such a logic? Secondly, if I told he was not wrong. Right. He didn't say they're not going to do that. Secondly, God said they're not going to do that. Bilal, let, a let us say, let us say, the God said Bilal, he's not going to do that. Bilal, Bilal, Bilal. Listen, 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 God listen, didn't listen, say listen. they're not going to do that. Bilal, Bilal, let me That's ask what you, you have to understand. Let me ask you a, 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 a simple question. Don't try to twist it. Okay, do you think Allah didn't say they're not going to do that? What do you mean? Correct or not? No, Allah, he said, Allah said they're not going to. He it. said, if you are a truthful, that means you are lying. No, no, no. Did God say they're going to? They are going to mischief. Oh, they're not going to mischief. Did he say that? He, yes, he said that because if they are a truthful, this is what will happen. If they are not a truthful, that will not happen. Oh, so what is, what that. is the angel that yeah. said? The angel did not say that Adam will eat cheese kebab. The, the angel did not say he will eat hummus. The angel they said he will do mischievement. So he said to them, tell me the names of those things if you are truthful. So the only argument is about what? About Adam will do mischievement. So if you are truthful, tell me. If you pass the exam, that's mean you know the unknown. That's mean you know the truth. That's mean you know that Adam will do mischievement. I know what you know not. Mean he will not do that. And I am telling you that because I know the names of those things. You do not know the names of those things. So Allah, he proved to the angel that he knew the unseen by giving things names, which is very silly. If you, I, if you have a dog with you or a cat and you name your cat Susu and you say to me, Christian Prince, what is the name of my cat? I say to you, I do not know. Is that proving that you are God? That is the most stupid excuse ever. Because if Allah is the one who named the things and then he asked them what the name of those things and they could not, that will not prove that Allah knows the unseen. It should be the opposite. Allah should say, okay, go behind the wall and give names for those things and don't tell me.
and come here and ask you the names, and then I will tell you the names. But what he did is the opposite, showing us that the one who came with the story is a kid. Because you naming something and then asking someone else what is the name, that will not prove that you know the unseen. Because it is seen by you. You are the one who gave them the names. So it's a very stupid story coming from a very silly book, and there's no excuse for such a thing. Same time, you are the one who said that the angels they were truthful, and Adam did mischievement. And when Adam he did mischievement, it was Allah's decision for Adam to do mischievement, or it was against the will of Allah. All right. So, so um, where did the angels get that information from? I don't know. You tell me. Maybe from Facebook. From Facebook? You tell me. How how come the angels they know more than your God? I'm not, uh how I'm asking angels, you, I'm asking you, where did, where did they get that information? Me, don't from? ask me, this is your story, this what? is your God, ask your what? God, my friend. Why? You're the, the one, one You're the one that knows, right? No, you're the I one that knows, right? The one is laughing at the story, and you need to tell me where the angels, they got their information from, because this is a question that is proof to us that the Quran is not a book to explain anything. It's a silly book, there's no answers. If I ask you the same question... So who, who, okay, who, uh, okay, who was on earth before us, man? Us say, who was on earth before let man? Us say, let us say, for the sake okay, of... Anyway, Hold on. Okay. I will go, I will use your question here, Allah, how the angels they knew, I'm waiting okay, for good. the answer. Allah, inshallah you get it in your dream. Um, GP, what? do you, do you, do you, uh, inshallah you get it in your dream, I said, you asked Allah, inshallah you get it in your dream. Ah, said, so I am going to have no. it in the dream, it is not in inshallah, the dream, I, I, so you can't answer I said inshallah, so anybody that knows so, Arabic, so, inshallah means God willing, God willing. First of all, inshallah is not an Islamic word. It is a Jewish okay. man who taught you the prophet. Okay, it's a, Jew, it's, a Jew, it's a Jewish word. We're going to use it, inshallah. No, no, We're going to use it. Exactly. We're, no, we're no, going to use it. The, the, the Jew, I, can I use no, a Jewish the word Jewish, or no? no you I'm not allowed? No, you cannot. You can use Allah, yeah. but you cannot Why? use. You cannot it's use haram? God is willing because your God, your prophet was. It's, it's haram to use the you, uh, you Jewish you word? You it's prophet, haram? Yes, because the prophet. Haram? Yes, haram, because your prophet says khalifuhum, which means don't say what they say. Don't do what they do. Is it? This is your. No, no. This, is your this is your no. prophet. This is your prophet. Your prophet. He's so. I'm speaking English now, so I shouldn't be speaking English. Your prophet. So I shouldn't be speaking English. Hold on. Your prophet. He was speaking, a, I uh, your prophet. He was a praying. A Jewish walked by, and, and, okay, and the I'll Jewish man okay. he said to him, "This is how we do it." Your prophet. He said, "Sit down. Sit question. down." Act differently. I'm ask so you're question, not actually, allowed patient, to sure. act like them, to sure. say like them. Secondly, the word inshallah, which means God is willing, as Muslims they mean, it means that you believe in a God who have a will. Do you have the? You, do you believe in the will of God? Okay, uh, fair enough, CB. I don't want to jump into that. Can I ask you a question? I have a question uh, about something. Mm -hmm. Can I ask you? Go ahead. You want to change the topic, right? No, no, no. I... Because we we did not finish about Adam. According to your prophet, Adam he commits sin. Adam he commits sin because Allah he forced him to do that, and this is the height in front of you. It is in Sahih al Bukhari. Do, so my question, my question is: Do do Christian uh, eat uh, like uh, you know in this, in Muslims we uh, there's the halal meat, mm. and in, in in Judaism they have kosher. Mm. Do Christians have anything like that, CP? What do you mean? Like kosher meat okay. or halal meat? First of all, yes, we have something is called kosher meat, but Muslims, all the food the Christian they eat is halal for them. Correct or no? All the food that Christians eat? Yes. All the food that Ahl al Kitab eat? So yes. Christians and Jews. Yes. Well, your God, He called us people of the book, which means we are the one of a book, and you don't have one. So no, not not you, CP. Not you who believes in a Son of God. Not you, uh, uh, CP. Well, your Quran, not you. Your Quran, the real Christian. Your Quran called the, Christian. the people. Hold on, just to show everybody not how. Okay. Like you. okay, so not you saying, like you. Okay, hold, hold on. So are you saying that when Allah He says the people not, of the book, yeah. He means those who don't believe that Jesus is Son of God? No, no. I'm telling you what uh, what uh, Ahlul Kitab. 
Okay. Uh, look, yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'm, I'm, let me repeat the question. You are not listening. Okay. You are not listening. Relax. 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 Look, Let me repeat the question slowly. Hold on. Are you saying? Are you saying? Are you saying? Hold on. Are you saying? Listen carefully. Are you saying that when the Quran says people of the book, he mean only those who don't believe that Jesus is son of God? I am saying the true. One hmm. that had the original. This is not the Bible. question. This is not the question. When you go, listen, listen carefully. Okay. Listen carefully. You. Listen you. carefully. When you God, yeah. He called a group of people, the people of the book. Do He mean everybody who believe in Jesus as Son of God, or only those who don't believe in Jesus to be Son of God? Allah says in the Quran, uh, He names the. Uh, 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 why you don't give me an answer? Give me the answer and tell me what Allah said in the Quran. I'm asking I give you, you. I give you my Allah, answer. I give, I give my answer, answer first. Give me the answer. When Allah He says, "People of the book," do He mean the ones who believe in Jesus to be the Son of God, or those who don't believe in Jesus to be the Son of God? Which one? Uh, Allah mentions them in two different ways, so I do not know. This, uh, a second ago, you know, a second ago you say he don't mean the Christians. No, a second, the ago, uh, look, a second up. ago, a second ago you say he. A second ago, you said, no, no, I'm telling people, you. What does it mean, book, What does it mean, uh, uh, kitab? You are being, what does it mean, friend, my, my friend, you are being hypocrite, and you are. Uh, oh, you're uh, being. Uh, you're, no, you're, you're, you're trying to you are, me. You're trying you to corner me, but you know what? You're biting your tongue. You are biting your tongue. Did you say? I'm biting my tongue. Did you say? Did you say that? You, it, when you, when the Quran did you give me the original the Bible that was given to Jesus? Please, did you give me the original gospel? Did you say, did let us repeat it again. Did you say, did you give me the original when the Quran, gospel? When the Quran say the people that don't mean those no, who worship Jesus of God, King James Version, King James Version. everybody heard Trump you, version. everybody heard you, Mark Version, this is translation, this is translation, this is translation, uh, Mark version. this is translation, this is translation, you are being, you are being silly now, Yusuf Ali Version, Yusuf Ali Version, where did King James come from? Muhammad Khan Persian, the Wadi Persian, community Persian, uh, uh, Arbari uh, Persian, the, the, Persian, uh, not Arab, Persian, version, 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 sorry, version. So all of those are those are translations. So you are a fool again, and you are changing the topic to escape. So I'm asking you again. How many versions? We have one version of the Quran. When, when, you said, when you said, no, you don't have one version of the Quran. Even your prophet, he make it clear. Okay, you don't have one version no. of the Quran. Hold on. We can, we can go there. Don't change the topic. Don't change the topic. We will go there. Everybody will laugh at you in a, in a second. In a second. Even, even, even Aisha, she said that Omar al-Khattab, he said that the Quran was a 1,025,000 letter. And now we don't have even 270 letters of it. So more, more than 90% of the Quran is gone. Don't go there now. We will go there later. Now I'm asking you. When you said, when you said, when you said that the people of the book, when the Quran speak about the people of the book, that means yeah. those who don't believe that Jesus is Son of God. Are you biting your tongue yeah. back for what you said, or you are going to admit that you were wrong? Hello? I'm listening, I'm waiting for you. Do you admit that you did you did not tell the truth when you said when the Quran used the word the word of God, or sorry, the book of God, the, the, the people of the book, he meant those who believe. You you said that he meant those who believe that Jesus is not Son of God. Are you sure from what you just said or you made a poo poo? No, Allah said in the Quran he he calls the the, the the Christian, the what he, he says, uh, the Christian, uh, who who say that Jesus is the Son of God, he names, he says that in the Quran. This is not the that question. Is this is not the question, Bilal. You are in trouble. So, 
no, no, you're not the, in trouble. But the, now we have to understand you did, you did, what does it mean? You did dig a hole. What did you did dig a hole. What did I say? Uh, did you, did you dig no, no, I didn't dig a hole. I'm, I'm telling you, okay. what was the initial topic? The initial topic uh, okay. so was what? So give me the answer. Uh, do you guys have Do you guys you have said, a halal or Who said you have a you. Are you I gave, didn't. You gave me the I don't see in one supermarket in Canada and America where they have kosher. Only the Jews. Only the Jews eat the kosher. Don't go to Walmart. Don't go to Walmart yet. Don't go to Walmart. Walmart, you are running away. I'm asking you. You well, said. Where are you said. You said. Where everybody heard you. Show you me said, one Christian who eats kosher. Please. You, oh, oh, Show so me listen, one Christian. Listen. Listen. You I said. You eat kosher. You said. You said. You eat kosher. Listen, Ibn Farouk. Listen. I'm asking you. Listen, listen. When you say to me that yeah. when, when the Quran, do you eat kosher? When the Quran, said, do you eat kosher? I'm asking you. you said, do you eat kosher? You said when the Quran, do you eat kosher? Me, the answer listen, is 100 percent no. You don't eat when kosher. When you say to me, no. the Quran, when the Quran, and there's every Christian book. I was raised in the West, not like you. you. Unlike you, I was raised in the West, and I understand and, and how, uh, how the Christians are. I want a clear There's answer what? to repeat what you just said. No Christians eat kosher, you bro. No Christians. Is, this it's this only Jews topic. eat okay. kosher. Okay, guys, and Muslims did you hear, did you hear eat halal. Said? Did you hear what he said? He said, no Christian eat kosher. So why Allah he allow you to eat the, the, the food of the Christians? Go ahead. We eat halal. We eat halal. No, we eat halal, brother. And let me the, tell you. It says and, in the Quran. And we eat halal ignorant. kitab. Ibn Farouk, you are ignorant. We chapter 5, chapter 5, chapter 5, verse number 5, chapter 5, verse number 5. It says, I made lawful for you today all the food of the people of the book. All yes. their food. All their food. What book, all though? Their what, food. What, what, what book do you follow? Chapter 5, verse number 5, the Quran what? says so. So the Quran what saying, do you follow? What, about the Christian? You, what version you see, do you follow? You are trying to change Christian the topic what because, you? Ibn Farouk, you, are, okay, you, became, you, became, you, became, you follow the Torah. Okay, we follow the Torah. Follow the Torah. What do you guys you follow? You became a joke for everybody. First, you use fake you name. Follow? Secondly, now you are trying How to change versions? the topic. How many versions? Do you see? want a divorce? No problem. Okay, Bro? hold on. As long as you are saying how many versions we believe. So how your God, he says, how I confirm, how I confirm, I confirm the Book, I want to read the original Bible. Do you I'm have ask, it? I'm asking you. Uh, do you have the original Bible? See, you are trying to change. I want to read the original Bible. Do you have it? You are a coward. You are I'm running asking. away from the topic. We have I'm Arabic. asking you. I'm asking we you. We have Arabic. Okay. Do you have the in original Bible? Uh, in front of everybody. Yeah. Did Tell you, me the original Bible. Let me read it. In, did your God he he approve the book we have? Did your God approve it or not? I'm asking you, I'm asking you, do you have don't, the original gospel? Answer. Please tell me. Yes, yes. we have, no. we have, we have. And the proof is in the Quran. Where is it? The proof is in the Quran. In the proof is in the Quran. We have it. You can, you can download from There's the Internet. There's only one in, in Jerusalem? We have, or the, no? we have the Hebrew. There's only we have one? the Aramaic. We have it everywhere. Now I'm asking you, do you have the original Quran? Yes, we do. Where? The, the Quran is with us. What do you mean, where? The Quran where, is the Quran. Where, where is the book of Muhammad? The Arabic. You have the Arabic. You have the Arabic. Recitation. You can read it everywhere. It. Ibn Farouk, listen, everybody is laughing at you. You have recitation of a yeah. guy, his name is Hafs, and the Muslim, they accuse him to be a thief, and he is the son of Hassan. And Hassan was a thief, and oh. I can show you right now what the reference is. Shut up. And in, even in the book, yeah. in your hand, <laughs> even in the book in your hand, listen, it, says, listen, it, says, listen. it says, Ibn Farouk, you're an idiot, you're a liar. Awesome you is it's how you recite it. It's how you recite it. I want you to open the page number Stop being an idiot. Number it's one. how page you recite it. Page number eight. Don't tell me how to ask them. It's how you recite this it. This book is according to the recitation how you recite of Hafs. Ibn Asim, oh, Ibn Rajul, wow. the son of etc. The son of etc. According to, according to, according to, according to, according to, according How to. How you recite it? There's different ways to recite so it. You have but it's the same Arabic. of a guy. He is a thief who was exist 200 years after Muhammad. You know, Arabic. Arabic. Now let's go back to the topic. You coward. It's the same Chat, Arabic. Chapter two. Ibn Farouk Ibn Mustafa. I'm so thankful you called me today. You're, you're chapter an idiot. two. You'll find out you're chapter an idiot. two. But you're a man. Well, well, how many people enjoy your Facebook? You're a real man. Your face, Everybody, you are wearing a you're a man. Are these Christian women? They show up to the face, bro. You're a coward, bro. You're a crusader, bro. You're a crusader. Your stupid woman says, I believe in the book which is with you. Don't be a coward. Listen, you coward. Don't be a coward. Show your face. Don't be a coward. 
Let's go. You know, the fuck on camera, TP. He wanna call me. I'm looking behind. He wanna call me. Don't be a coward. Don't be a coward, TP. It is you. Those Christian, those Christian debaters that you talk shit about. At least they're men. At least they're men. Those Christian debaters. At least they're men. At least they're men. They show their face. Christian wood. All those guys I respect them. Those Christian because they show their face. Not like you. Not like you, man. You hide behind the screen. Go show your face. Go. Go, go, go do it in public. <laughs> go, go, go. So guys, go be look, a crusader, okay. man. Be a real Christian crusader, bro. Don't be a little thing. I am doing a crusader. Right I am in doing the a basement. crusade right now. I'm doing a shish crusader. kebab. Your so right in Allah, the he confirmed what is with us in your stupid book. He yeah. hung up the coward. He changed his name. He jumped from a topic to a topic. He thought we will not know that this is him, Ibn Farouk, the coward, the son of Muta. And he don't want to continue in the topic. This is the guy who he said he can debate me. In two minutes, we made him shish kebab. And he hung up the coward. Confirming which is with you, the Quran said. Chapter 2, verse number 41. Uthman ibn Farouk, you coward. Coward, why you hang up? Let's call him back. Listen, boy. Gotta go shop, boy. Listen, boy. Listen, chapter, little... chapter two. Be a man, like, chapter like two. Like other verse number man, like other I gotta go shopping. Be a man. I'm with my daughter. Huh? This is more what, what, important than shopping. Listen, I get home home this is more important than shopping. And you call me to debate me. You wanna do shopping now? What? You wanna buy condoms? I can show you the hate about it. Uh, Tazilu. Coward. I wanna do shopping, right? Who is running? He want to do shopping. Panty shopping. So, we heard the liar saying that when the Quran say, people of the book, he mean those who don't believe that Jesus is son of God. How truthful this coward is. Did you notice how in the speed of light he jumped in from topic to topic thinking he can escape the humiliation which is coming from Christian Prince? You made a big mistake when you call me, even you use a different name. But you stupid, you idiot. This is the Quran. Keep calling the people, people of the book, and they are kuffar. And you said, and everybody heard you saying, when Allah, he said the people of the scriptures, he mean the true Christians who don't believe that Jesus is son of God. It is recorded. It is going to be the end of your career, you coward. <laughs> 